Hey guys, a quick review on all these products. Stay tuned just to see what I have to say about these. Hi guys, so this video is me talking about some products that I've recently finished. I have four products to talk about. Um, it's going to be, I'm going to try and keep this video reasonably short not to bore you and everything because some of the products you've probably heard about before and had or have seen videos on them so you know you've seen it before but um yeah four products that I have finished um really really love all of them and I have actually repurchased three of them or I have repurchased the other one but a different kind didn't you know I'll get to that in a minute but yeah um first of all I'm going to talk about something I received in a glossy box a while ago now um, I have actually sub unsubscribed from glossy box because I just thought it's like just it's £10 a month and I don't get lots of things that I like there's the odd month when you get something you really really like and then there's other months where you're just like meh and I just thought you know it's kind of a waste of my money but um, if you've got a kind of choice of what you've got like you could tick I want either one of those or one of those I think that might be better but you know whatever but this came in a glossy box I think it was like October or November last year and it's called the Rituals Indian Rose and Sweet Almond Oil Foaming Shower Gel Sensation it's a bit of a mouthful but I have actually repurchased this along with another um scent one as well or flavour or whatever you want to call it um the mandarin and mint one which is in a red can this is in like a bright fuchsia pink but this stuff is amazing it lasts forever it's 200 ml can and i've just finished it and it's like what is it now like coming up to mid april or something yeah um just finished it it lasts a good long time um as it says, it's a foaming shower gel and it comes out in a gel like form. And I'm going to put a little bit on my hands because I think there's a little bit left. But it comes out like that. There you go. And yeah, it just looks like a gel. But then it starts to change colour into like a white foamy kind of consistency. And it smells absolutely amazing. It's just like, you want to kind of like eat it. It's just so floral and pretty and beautiful it's just like a really lovely smell and i actually like using this as a shaving gel i know it's probably not a shaving gel but i really really just love this product and my hand was dry so it foams up really well and even dry skin imagine when it's like on wet skin it just foams up really well i'm gonna wipe this off so i don't get this everywhere but it is a really lovely product um comes from a ritual store um, or on my website. I know there's lots of places that do like concession stands. I picked up my new bottles or canisters in House Fraser in London, the one at Monument Station. And I know there is a, a store near Selfridges in London and there's a store in Lakeside, Essex. And there's a concession in the House of Fraser there as well just so you know but you can like I'll put the link to the store so you can see because I think it's kind of worldwide as well I'm not entirely sure if that's true but it is you know you can pretty much get it anywhere I think or order it in but my kind of like review alone should make you want to buy this I think because if you like rosy smells and something that makes your skin soft and just you know, mm, lovely. Um, I would definitely check these out. They do do a, quite a few smells. I think there's about eight or something like that of different ones that you can buy. But yeah, I think they're even available on John Lewis as well. That's just popped into my head. Yeah, John Lewis um, as well. I've seen him in Canary Wharf. But yeah, um, I would definitely. This is going to be. It's six pounds fifty. But I know sometimes they do little offers of like um, buy two for eight or something like that. But I know it's six pounds fifty, but it lasts you a good long while. I mean, I got it late last year. I know it was probably about October, November or something like that in my box, my glossy box. So I just finished it. So you know, it's 
last me a good long time. My next product I'm going to talk about is something I like, but I have repurchased another one of the brand. And this is the 3D Minute Miracle Luscious Long Deep Treatment by Aussie. Um, I've actually repurchased the deep, take the heat one instead because I thought that one, I'd used that one before this and then, because this was a Christmas present, so I used it up and I just preferred the take the heat. It is so lovely, I love it anyway, I'd still buy it if the take the heat was discontinued, but I just prefer take the heat. But um, yeah, it just makes your, your hair so luxurious and soft and silky and I love Aussie products anyway, and I always try and buy them in like Boots or Superdrug if it's like two for a fiver or three pound, um, get free and get the cheapest one free, which I, I did in Boots recently, so I got a 4 99 Aussie for free, because I did the free, buy free, get, yeah, you know what I mean. Um, sorry, get confused. But um, yeah, I would definitely recommend Aussie if you just like to give your hair a little bit of TLC. Um, yeah, I have enough said on that really, it's just really lovely and and it smells good too, so yeah. Um, another product which everyone probably knows about, so I won't go on too much about it, is the Liz Earl Cleanse and Polish Hot Cloth Cleanser. I love this, um, I purchased this a while ago, kind of was a bit meh about it and then I restarted using it, I really really love it. Um, this one's completely empty and I don't have another one to start using yet because it's like been bank holiday and, you know, I just haven't been able to go out and get it down blue water because it's not obviously available, like, easy for people. You either have to, like, mail order it or go to a certain store, which is quite annoying. I wish it was stocked in, like, super or boots because I think that would be so much easier for people if you could literally just go... To your local boots or like a boots like one of the bigger boots and just go in and get it because i just find it annoying that you have to even mail order it or i mean i live in essex and now my closest store to get this is either blue water um what is it the blue water john lewis or house of fraser something like that or i have to go all the way to oxford street which you know it's just really frustrating that it isn't really available it is available but you know it's a bit hard to get your hands on it and I just think that it's a little bit frustrating with this because you know you can't always like just drive off to somewhere to get it and I don't know I'm just rambling now but it's a little frustrating and I just think I am going to do a review on this because I took some scary pictures of myself removing my makeup with this and I just think this stuff is the bomb. <laughs> Sorry, I had to do my little the bomb. But yeah, it's amazing and I would recommend this to anyone if you, it takes off all makeup. I mean even like I've got quite a lot of makeup on my eyes today like under eyeliner under eyeliner, yeah, and um, mascara and stuff, and it will remove all that. I mean, your muslin cloth will look awful afterwards, but it just gets rid of it all. It's amazing. Um, next product I'm going to quickly talk about is the I Love GC small bottle I got in my Lush haul, which I will link below if you want to see that. Um, I love this stuff. I've actually bought a new bottle, the bigger bottle, because... I just, I love this stuff. For oily hair, it's amazing. It strips every bit of grease and grime out of your hair. And your hair is actually squeaky clean after using this. I just, I couldn't recommend this enough. And like this with like an Aussie afterwards as a conditioner. Also, I don't use this as just a treatment. I use this as an everyday, not everyday, but a normal conditioner. Just to let you know. But yeah, um... This, like stripping everything out of your hair, and then like an Aussie putting all the lusciousness back in. It's just such a great combination. I really recommend I Love Juicy, especially if you have oily hair. And also I like the way they do different size bottles as well, because, you know, you don't have to buy the big one. I bought a small one just to test it out, and it is amazing. So if you have 
have greasy hair go check out I Love Juicy by Lush so yeah that's my quick little review on the things I've used up recently and I might do a blog post I don't know but yeah there you go so I hope you have a great day or whatever and I will speak to you all soon bye